And what is going on everybody? I'm Ziggly Toaster here and today we are playing some more CSR Classics. Uh, I'm going to try to progress in the story. I don't know how far I'm going to get. I don't know how much I'm going to get to. And I don't know exactly what is going to happen in this episode. My main thought is to progress in the story, but you know how I am. Like, I plan on doing one thing and then I go off and do a million other things that aren't the one thing. So I could end up doing literally anything else. So let's see how this goes. This is not a filler video, but it is a video for me to get out there. I mean, I, I, I do have thought into this episode, but at the same time, I don't. I don't know how else to describe it. Right now, I think I'm going to just get up to stage 2 real quick. Just on all of them. Maybe do stage 3 later. I'm not trying to spend massive amounts of money. But I'm trying to upgrade at least a little bit. So. Exhaust. The exhaust is actually pretty inexpensive. For every car. Nitrous is quite expensive. So anyways, we're on stage 3. Let's go see what decals we have. So let's just slippy slidey over here. That's ugly. Actually, you know what? I've seen that. I've seen that same livery on like the rust colored ones, and it looks pretty all right. And then we have this one. All right. So let me go change the color of this car real quick. It's not going to stay this color. But like this color looks really good. Come on, phone. Actually, like, work for once. <laughs> Give me one second. Okay, so as I was saying, I really like how this color and this decal look together. Like, both look atrocious apart from each other. When you add them together, it actually looks pretty nice. I mean, to me at least. Let's go change... Nope, let's go change the color of the car back to blue. Um, let's go back to racing. Uh, don't have a Dodge that'll fit that category, but let's go race. I'm going to call her Flower. Flower looks sweet enough, but you don't want to see what she can do when she's angry. You wouldn't make her angry, would you? I'm about to make her the most angry pink-haired woman alive. Real quick, let's just take that Mopar and just walk it. Slow start. And we just take off. A uh, bye bye See you later. Hope you like the look of my tail lights. The key to any fast car is a good looking set of tail lights. Because that's all your opponent's going to be saying. Just that. Oh, honey buns, I warned you not to make Flower angry. Better lock that hotel door tight tonight. I mean, if she's willing to go to my... Uh, no, nah, I'm joking. The Banshee? Tell me down in the comment section if you know anything about this car. Because it looks like a Pontiac version of a Corvette. Like, make it yellow, and it looks like a Corvette. If you see it from a distance, or if you just squint a little bit, it looks like a Corvette. So. Anyways, let's see what else we got. Boop. Simone. Alright. The only thing Simone loves more than her guitar is the sweet smell of engine oil. She's a gas. Huh? Okay. Well, that made zero sense, but... Okay. What is that? Ooh, that's also a firebird. Yeah, I'm gonna win this real quick. She's lighter, but I still have more power. More power, baby. More power, baby. More power, baby. That makes no sense if you don't watch Donut Media. But if you watch Donut Media, a good little reference. More power, baby. Not even Simone gets beat. Maybe I need to get to know you better. 
All you need to know is that I got a fast F body. An effing fast F body. Don't want to use harsh language in this because the big ol' eye of YouTube will look down upon me and take away any chance of me getting monetized. At least in the future, I don't get monetized now. Wow, I am spending way too much money. So exhaust. And nitrous upgrade. Boop. Now let's go see what we have for decals. So let's just shoot actually this way, because this way is a lot faster. That's pretty nice. Looks pretty good in red, actually. And then we got the stripe down the middle. Eh, they're both kind of ugly. That's still extreme? I'm almost fully upgraded, come on. Anyways, let's go race Pearl. Nobody ever gave Pearl a dime. She's a tough broad. And she won't give up without a fight. Then alright. Let's go. Let's see what she's driving. What is that? Move the thing? Oh, is that a challenger? I think it's a challenger. Pretty sure it's a challenger. Dodge challenger. Yeah, definitely a challenger. Again, we walked it. We gone. We disappeared. Well, actually, no, we're not disappearing, but... 11.121. Which is funny, because 11 times 11 is 121. Oh, great. Now I've got to deal with Pearl tearing up the place. I'll make you pay for that. All right. Try to reach into my pockets. Try to get try to get my try to get my wallet. I dare ya. I dare ya. You know what? Let's race her the first time. Let's see if we can see if we can beat her without even having to modify any more. Without even having to modify any more. That whole sentence was a mix up the first time. Candy's a hard nut to crack. She's Marco's girl, but flirts with Baladine all day long. At first, I thought maybe she was trying to get rid of Marco, but it doesn't seem so. We need to dig a little deeper. You made it here at last, huh? Let's see how let's see how you do against a real mover. I mean, I can't quite race myself, so I don't know. I don't know. Against a Corvette. Okay. And a swifty shifty. Swift. Oh, it's not swift enough. Come on. Come on! Bad shifting. Oh! You know what? Let's go for a rematch real quick. But for a rematch, maybe I can read it. Maybe I can. Maybe I can actually get something out of you. Maybe I can get a win. A dub. Big ol' fat dub ski. Perfect start. Good shift. Perfect shift. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Pull, 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 pull. F word I don't want to say. It's all glamour. It's not all glamour and glitz out here, honey buns. Sometimes you just have to hit the gas and race. <sighs> Alright, well, I'm going to save those for the next episode. Anyways, I'm not ending the episode here. I'm just, you know, saving those for the next episode. Uh, how much do I have for the next pip of gas? Five bucks? Five minutes? I almost said five bucks. Um... Might as well do a challenge. Might as well do a daily battle. I mean, get to race someone else's car. I didn't see what this was. Oh, it was a DB4 GT Sagata. This thing revs out to ten thousand. This thing's been revving out to ten thousand since before Honda even did it. 
And you have to modify Honda to do that. I won by .005 of a second. That's crazy. Let's go race someone else's car again. You know, let's just do all three daily battles. Why not? This is a tall, massive, monster truck, I swear. How is it so fast? It was so fast, I missed a shift. It went ba 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 ba. I beat 10 seconds. I beat a 10 second quarter mile in a stock Barracuda. What? It's restored, it's not modified other than the nitrous. Oh, that's great. <laughs> I beat 10 seconds. That's gnarly. Not even my not even my GT350R does that. Anyways, what's this? Ooh, it's a Shelby Cobra. The original Shelby Cobra before the Cobra name was put onto the Mustang. Since when have these things been revving out to 10,000? Well, I'm guessing 67. When they were created. Oh no, I think they were created in 64. I don't know. All I know is that I lost. Which kind of sucks. Ending the video on a loss. Well, you know what? Actually, no. I'm not. I'm going to pause the video, wait for that 2 minutes and 30 seconds, and I'll come back to you and get a dub. Alright. Another pip of gas. I don't know why I keep calling it a pip. I think the original, like when this game was still being updated, I think they used to call it a pip. I'm not sure. Doesn't say here. But like back when it still had online and it still had like updates and stuff. It, I think they used to call it a pip. I'm not 100% sure. But anyways, let's take the GT500 out for... You know, the last race of the episode. $6,750 win. A big ol' fat dubskis. Big ol' W. Double U. Stands for win. That's all I'm gonna do. Is that an AMC AMX or just a Javelin? Or is it a... Javelin AMX? I don't know. Give me a second. Uh, I'm gonna go find it real quick. I'll pause the video, find it, and then it'll pop up right when I get to there. Okay, so it is just a Javelin. This is the Javelin AMX. It doesn't say Javelin, but that's because it needs room to say Super Stock. It's the same. It, it looks almost exactly the same. Just a little body modification here and there. But, you know... The AMX was basically a Javelin with the back seats removed, if I'm not mistaken. I learned that from Foos, or Overhauling was the show. Actually, I don't even think Foos said it. I think it was the main guy, not Chip Foos himself, but like the one that actually went out and like was talking to the people and convincing them that they were doing stupid stuff with their cars when really they were going to be overhauled. You know, the one that was always saying like, you know, like, Buddy, you're about to be overhauled, or you've been overhauled, or you know, I don't remember what his name was. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna spend the time to Google it. If you know who I'm talking about, then you can at least picture his face. You may not know his name, but you can picture his face. Maybe you might be able to name his name, and you're a lot smarter than I am. I mean, I don't doubt it. I mean, I've met six-year-olds that are smarter than me. I've met dogs that are smarter than me. Now see, you may think I'm joking, and you may not think I'm joking. I'm gonna leave that up to you. But anyways, I'm gonna end the video here. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you disliked the video, leave a dislike. Tell me down in the comments section why you liked or disliked the video. Also in the comments, uh, talk to me down in the comments section, actually. 
I love giving thumbs up, hearts, and positive replies to positive, supportive comments. I'll never react negatively to a negative comment because that's quite mean and I'm all about spreading positivity. As you can see in my Twitter, which is a good segue to uh, my social media being down in the description. Twitter's down there. I love to use that a lot. I use that for, like, you know, positivity, just posting things that are positive. Like, I think the other day I posted, like, you're beautiful, don't forget that. You know, something like that. I truly believe all that. I put all that just to stay positive, and hopefully someone out there will, like, see it, and that might, it might make their day a little better. Who knows? Uh, Instagram number one is to keep up with me and the channel. Uh, Instagram number two is automotive-based one, cars, trucks, motorcycles. Uh, I think I'm going to put a video game post out as of tomorrow, which is the day before you watch this. Um, yeah, you'll find something there you like, and hopefully you like a lot of the posts, and hit that follow button, because it really helps. Um, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell icon to be notified when post videos, I post every other day, but not as a time, so that's what you need the bell icon for. And, I hope you liked the video, and thanks for watching.